Workers Day is very important to workers in South Africa because it's their holiday. Uh, they have uh, achieved uh, this holiday based on their struggle uh, since uh, in the very early years uh, when uh, workers were up in arms throughout the world because this is an international uh, workers' day. In South Africa, the workers have to celebrate the achievements that they got uh, after democracy. Firstly, we have the legislation uh, that protects the workers in this country, the Labor Relations Act that allows the workers to deal with the bargaining issues. And at the same time, it also allows the workers uh, to have uh, discussions and elect their own uh, leaders in the workplace. So they do have the freedom of association. And secondly, we have the Basic Conditions of Employment Act that deals with the conditions under which the workers should be employed. And I do believe that the employers do comply with those legislation. But at the same time, we do have uh, the Employment Equity Act that deals with the equality in the workplace, where we are saying when the workers are doing the work of the same value, then those workers must be paid equally. And that deals with the issues of discrimination. And at the same time, we have the national minimum wage that was passed last year and implemented early this year. Uh, the national minimum wage uh, is going to benefit a lot of workers, particularly when you look at the hospitality industry, because those workers were just being paid uh, the tips only. So now what they have now is the basic salary and tips are going to be part of uh, the, 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 the incentives by uh, those that they will be uh, helping. And the people that are going to benefit from the national minimum wage, they are over 6 million. After we have done our research as the department, we find out that about 8 million workers are going to benefit from the national minimum wage. But at the same time, I must say, under social protection as well, we do have the Unemployment Insurance Act and the compensation uh, of, uh, of injuries uh, uh, on duty and diseases. And that protects the workers, particularly when the worker has been injured. And then the worker can be compensated while the worker is being treated for that injury. But at the same time, I must say, when it comes to the unemployment insurance, it protects the workers when they, they have been retrenched. And at the same time, when the companies have closed down, they can be able to claim, but only those who have been contributing to the unemployment insurance. And I must also say, we have just amended the unemployment insurance to increase the benefits of those who will be going on maternity leave because it does protect the workers when they are on maternity leave. And it also includes now the domestic workers, which were previously not recognized as workers. So those are the achievements, those are the achievements that the workers have to celebrate tomorrow.